Hey Stewie, do you want the stick? Yes you do, you ready? <laughs> well done. We'll have you as a show dog in no time. You're too crazy to be a show dog, Sheldon. You ready for another stick? Ready? Go! Come on, Stu! Good boy! <laughs> it's another Monday and that means we're baking and cooking again. And today we have Lila and Andrew with us as well, so it's all very exciting. And Tamar's here to eat food too. But today we're making um, lamb and chickpea tagine. That's just the picture, that's not what we've made just in case that fooled you, and um, blood orange cheesecake. So I just uh, chopped open a blood orange and wow, doesn't that look cool? Mm, so I need to juice some of these so that we can make the, uh, the jelly that's on the top, except we're not gonna have time for the cheesecake to cool to make the jelly and then set that on top and let it cool. So we're just gonna make the jelly separate and serve it like a sauce thing, like a condiment to go with the cheesecake. So anyway, that's the plan. It's gonna work out. It'll be fine, it'll be fine. But uh, it's all in the oven right now, cooking away. Yum. Luca is just enjoying the crumbs of our dinner, aren't you? Is it nice? Yeah. <laughs> She's cleaning up the floor from what the kids dropped at dinner time. But I should have actually vlogged it before we ate, but um, this is the leftovers of our, our tagine, our lamb and chickpea, and a bit of apricot in there as well. It was really good, really tasty, and uh, we would couscous with that, and that's what's left of that, but anyway. Um, and then our cheesecake, we had to make a bit different from the book because cheesecake needed time to cool before you put the jelly on, and then that needed time to cool, and we didn't have enough time for that, so we just did the cheesecake. And then we did jelly separate and took scoops of jelly and put it on, on our cheesecake instead. So, all in all, really very good. Cheesecake, however, took longer to cook than the cookbook said. So I need to make a note of that in the book. Um, but yeah, you need to have a bit of head knowledge when you're making things to, to know what it should look like. <laughs> instead of just paying attention to what the book says all the time. So anyway, but it was really good, really tasty. And it's actually the first baked cheesecake that I've made that I really liked. I haven't been a big fan of baked cheesecakes in the past, so I think that's a keeper, that one. I might uh, bookmark that recipe for again sometime and do some other flavors with it and stuff like that. Anyway, like a, she's just sniffing away, can you hear? <laughs> anyway, I will see you tomorrow. Bye.